Hi everyone, so it's the season of some glam, glitz and glow and of course we can leave our babies out. So in today's video, I will show you how to achieve this gorgeous hairstyle which of course don't only have to be done during the holidays but I feel like this is just something you can do any time of the year. All right, so let's just go ahead and quickly get started, guys, because I have two heads to make today. So we have um, some product right here. And of course, you need some maybe hair um, beads and, you know, some rubber bands. And for the for the braiding hair, what I'm going to be using is Brazilian wool, guys. Oh, my gosh. Like, I absolutely love this particular product right here. Like, if you don't want to use um, um, extension, right, hair braiding extension, Extension, you can opt for this one and the reason I absolutely love this one is the fact that it's very very flexible you know how sometimes when you use new um, braiding hair right it's so stiff but this one right here you don't even need to run it inside the water like hot water you don't need to do nothing to it. just braid and go that is you know one of the reasons I absolutely love this one right here and also it's very very cheap I got um five packs of it for ten dollars you know from amazon so the first thing i'm gonna go ahead and do is to kind of draw out the 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 what is it called the braiding hair right and it all depends on you it depends on what a length you want but for me i really wanted something longer you know some people do like short um this this style is actually called cock corkscrew if i'm not mistaken some people do it really short but i didn't want it so short so i used kind of the length of my hair to measure it and of course the next thing i went ahead to do was to section off the hair so for this hairstyle i wanted to keep it like four major um i wanted to cut the hair into four parts right and then each four each part of the four parts i'm going to braid three braids on it i don't know if i made sense so what i did was i went to the left side of her hair right i just cut the hair like from the end of her of her ear from the left to the end of her of her ear on the right so that way it's like i'm um, forming kind of a straight line but it's going to be like from ear to ear so as you guys can see me doing here i just cut her hair from this end and then i'm going to do it all the way to the back of her of her ear you know like at the back so that way i can i'm not, like i'm gonna get that even um kind of line when we are all done you guys are gonna see what i mean so over here i just went ahead and sectioned off the hair using um some hair bands and then um, as you guys are gonna see it's it's padded into four so i have one two three four you see what i mean so with this four right here each um each part of the four um cut out hair is gonna have three braids each so at the end of the day we're gonna be left with one that's three six nine twelve so we're gonna be left with twelve um braids right so of course i'm gonna be starting from this side of her hair and of course to make the hair very very sleek and nice you want to go ahead and use some gel and i absolutely love my ampro um styler gel because it has that very nice black tint to it so it kind of also helps to add some kind of color to the hair especially if your hair is brown or is black so of course that's what i did and i went ahead over here to use a um, rubber band to hold her hair i'm not a professional when it comes to braiding guys and an easy way that i've noticed you know something that helps me a lot when it comes to braiding is whenever i use band to kind of hold the hair some people that are used to braiding they just go ahead and start braiding but i can't do it that way so once i secured the that part of the braid i'm going to go ahead and now section it into three like i told you guys it's going to be like three braids each so that is basically what is going on here
all right so let's go ahead and get um started with the you know the braiding so with the braiding here i'm gonna um pick up six i had to count the strands guys like i didn't want the braid to be too thick or too small so something in the middle right so like something medium so i decided to go like as you all can see the wool actually comes in like one one strand so i decided to pick up six strands you know to be able to make the hair and also with the length i decided to kind of do it as you all can see like i sectioned it into three you know how like you have something long right and then you kind of make it into three of equal parts and then i ended up using one part like the shorter part so it's like i divided it into three and then i used one of the three to start off the hair so you want because you the one you're going to use to twist on the hair has to be far longer than the one you're actually twisting on i'm not sure if i'm making any sense guys that is basically what i did now so the one you guys can see me going it's kind of treading right it's like i'm treading the hair the one you guys can see me using to tread around is far longer than the one that is you know that i'm treading on oh my gosh i don't know if i made sense with what i'm just trying to explain um for you guys but yeah that is basically what i'm doing here so this hairstyle guys if you don't know how to braid this is so easy i mean this is this is just like as if you're treading a hair you know you just loop it around loop it around loop it around you just continue looping it around until you cover the whole hair this hairstyle is actually one style i'm going to be making for the girls because you guys like just imagine having like two girls or if you have three girls four girls five girls and you're the one ma making their hair it's you know it can take some time to get their hair done so you know for the fact that this one right here is so easy it's a blessing Lesson. so right now once i was done treading that particular um braid right you can then go in and you guys can see what i'm doing i'm kind of going back into tread back but now the one i'm treading back right now is the one i already twisted so you just want to tread it like you want to tread it all the way back i don't know if i made any sense and once i finish you know i'm um, kind of looping it around i'm gonna section off like the tip of the of the braid you know what is just left is gonna be something very small so you can go ahead and just divide that leftover hair into two as you as you guys can see me doing here and then you just go in and tie it up that is basically what i'm doing here so whatever is left of the hair you can just use it and then form a very tight um knot because you don't want the hair to get loose you know you don't want it to loosen up so once i get that done i just go in with my scissors and cut out whatever is left and that is it guys like look how beautiful look how like this hair oh my gosh the the hairstyle i absolutely love it and you know thank god i filmed it for you guys so because i know a lot of you will probably like for me though you know during any time of the year i'm always looking for hairstyles or even like especially now that it's christmas you want to be able to make your your girls you know your girl child you want to make their hair really really nice and everything so i feel like this style right here is just gonna be a very nice christmas hair for your girls and of course you can go ahead and add it you can beautify it with some ribbons with some um hair bands with anything colorful i absolutely love using some colorful um um bands you know on the girl's hair because because of the fact that the hair itself is black so putting colorful things on it just makes it look so good and yeah we are done with the first um part as you all can see i already made the three um braids for the first part so i'm gonna go ahead and you know do some off camera and then come back as you all can see thank god for editing because like just look at that that second i already braided two hair and i'm on this um on the sixth braid right now so over here i'm still doing the exact same thing just you know section the you want to kind of um um put the braiding hair into three parts you use one like the shorter length and then you start looping it around you just start treading it's very very easy guys just watch and see what i'm doing
And of course, when you're braiding and you feel like the hair is too long, right? You can have the child hold the, the hair. So that way it's not too long. And also when the hair is so long like that, like when you're braiding it, it can start pulling on the child's scalp. So you don't want that. So that is basically what you guys can see me, you know, doing here. I asked that to hold some part of the hair. So that way, you know, it will be easier for me to you know and also less painful for her even though the style it doesn't hurt like it's not painful at all and yeah over here as you all can see i just finished and i'm doing the exact same thing just going around to twist and when you are actually twisting the hair around the one you already treaded right you can also go ahead as you all, as you all can see me doing here you can actually also go ahead and start twisting it like you want the the, the hair you're looping around so give you that very nice twisted effect so if you're twisting it and you feel like oh like the the hair kind of losing the little bit you can just go ahead and twist it you know more so that way it will give you exactly what you want and once i am done you know looping the hair all around i can then go ahead and form the knot as you all can see like i said earlier i just divide whatever is left into two and then look i just twist it and i use it to form a knob and once i do that i i kind of like to do it two three times because one thing you don't want i hate it when i i finish making hair i now have to always go back to kind of redo and redo as and redo as they carry the hair right so just to make sure nothing is going to be loose you just want to tighten it very very well and then go ahead and use your scissors and then um, cut out whatever small um hair is left oh my gosh you guys like this um brazilian braiding hair is the business like i love it it's not stiff at all it's very very i don't know how to explain it like it's free you know when you're using it especially people actually use this um particular brazilian wool to braid like you can use it for your corn roll you can use it for your your braiding whatever it is it's just as if you're using um attachments you know it's as if you're using extension um braiding hair but this one is actually a wool and i absolutely love the way like you know this um particular hairstyle came out it's absolutely beautiful and for the price like five of these for ten dollars i actually only used one pack each for each each child's hair so that means and because of the fact that I wasn't sure of how big the bra the braiding hair was going to be so I ordered two sets so I ordered like five since it came with five for ten dollars i decided to add that other two packs which is um twenty dollars right so i ended up having ten packs and i didn't know it was that big you know so i had um i had i think ten ten in total and i only ended up using just one pack for one child's hair and then one one pack for the other child's hair so i ended up using two packs out of the ten so i still have like eight you know braiding hair left which i'm so happy about because i can you know when this hair is old i can take it off and at least i know i have braiding hair for them and yep you guys this is basically it as you all can see this is so easy it's so beautiful like the the hairstyle is something that you know especially from the part of um country or the the, the part i'm from in nigeria like during christmas moms you know homes they love to kind of beautify their baby their girls you know we even myself like during christmas like this i still go out to go and get my christmas hair done it's just the habit i'm used to and yeah like if you're looking for inspiration on what to do to your kids i hope you're inspired by this style it's so versatile it's very fast too because at the end of the day i always like hairstyles that are very fast and yep guys i hope you all enjoyed this video and please 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 don't forget to hit that like button below and also hit the subscribe button if you haven't already and till my next video i will see you all very very soon bye